Hey guys, this is Emerald Fire. Today I have for you a concrete color changer. It automatically changes the color of concrete that you put in into any other color using a glitch in the game where falling concrete blocks will take the data value of whatever concrete block is currently in that position, even if it's not the same concrete block that was originally there. All you have to do is stand here on this emerald block and hold down click and all the concrete powder in your inventory that you're putting down will be sent into the machine and converted into whatever color is currently selected. You can change the selected color by pressing this button over here. And I made it so that it fits all 16 colors of concrete powder and rotates through them as you press the button. Now I'll show you how to build it. Start where you want your output chest to be. We're going to first place the pistons that change the color of the concrete powder. We're going to have to set up the redstone so that the regular piston at the front retracts at the same time as the sticky piston at the back gets a zero tick pulse. That will cause the concrete powder to change color. Next, we're going to add the color selector. We'll make it so that pressing this button cycles through one color and goes on to the next one. There are 16 colors of concrete powder in total. We're going to need to stack up 8 of them here, and 8 of them here. There will also need to be 2 blocks of concrete powder in the back at all times. Don't press the button before these blocks are added, but after you add them, the machine will automatically stop converting before those two blocks are used up, so you won't have any problems in the future. Now it should be ready to use. The player stands at this emerald block here, which of course doesn't have to be an emerald block, and places blocks up against this emerald block up here. You can hold down right click or use a trick to make it AFK while holding down right click and that will continuously place concrete powder and won't place it off to the side because of the redstone dust there. You can also turn off this lever here and stack up the concrete blocks and then turn on the lever for automatic conversion of the entire pillar. And that's all there is for this video. I hope you found this tutorial useful. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time.